Hi, uh, my name is Mike Horizon. I work for Saudi Aramco, and uh, it's a company of about 70,000 employees. Um, it's broken down into what we call administrative areas, and the area that I work in is drilling and work over. Uh, I, I ran into my old boss, Terry Densmore. I used to work for Flynn Energy, and I've been involved with Taproot uh, since about 2001. And I, I'm a very good Taproot investigator, I'll tell you that, number one. And number two, I'm about an average intelligence guy, you know. And I tell this to all my students. So uh, I, I realized a long time ago this is a, a brilliant tool uh, that you can use for different areas. Uh, the best practice I'd like to share with you is, um, uh, you know, I, I've listened to folks talk about some of the struggles that they experience in their organizations. And uh, uh, I had the fortune, uh, the good fortune of coming into Aramco drilling and work over at the point where they're getting ready for a paradigm shift in in their culture, in their in, in their uh, HSE culture, and uh, uh, so uh, they were receptive to certain ideas that uh, possibly some of your organizations may be receptive to. Number one, uh, I realized quickly that. Uh, our upper management, people weren't telling them the truth. And so, um, you know, the things that our middle management were saying and their actions, they, they, weren't, uh, they weren't the same, you know. Uh, so we had, we had a lot of gaps in, um, in our reporting. Uh, I don't want to say hiding stuff, but say misclassifications. And, uh, and what I call investigation by committee, where you put a bunch of people together um, without a, a skill set such as Taproot, and you expect them to tell you what happened and give you recommendations. Uh, so what we, uh, what we did was, um, or what I did was using Taproot proactively identified some of the management gaps uh, in our management and some of the blocks that they were presenting to the full implementation in the field. And uh, you don't have to sell the message to all of them as long as you can get to the strategic people who basically tell all the rest of them what to do. Um, because it, it gets led from the top. Uh, I am a, a strong proponent of line management responsibility for safety. Uh, I believe that if you train management the right way, they can fire a lot of us, you know. Um, and so that's uh, that's where we, uh, you know, we went with that, with ours was getting management to uh, make it unacceptable to uh, not report everything. Uh, it was unacceptable to uh, follow up on implementation, and sometimes you have to use um, out of the box uh, strategies to to get that and. Bottom line is you got to man up, you know. If uh, if your ethical thermometer is in the right place, uh, you will do the right thing, you know. And if you're working with an organization that, um, say, doesn't want to do it the right way, there's lots of other jobs out there. So.